Well, good morning and welcome to the Big Learning Center here in our chapel. I'm so glad that you're here this morning and we're so glad that you're at summer fun this morning too. So we're going to start off with our first song, Our God is a Great Big God. Here we go.
or on the rug somewhere. Put your hands in the air, then back down, behind your back, on your stomach, on your knees, on your elbow, on your shoulder, on your chest, on your neck, on your chin, on your nose, ear, 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 shoulders, cross your arms and find your shoulders. Cross your arms, find your shoulders. Give yourself a big hug. Raise your elbows up and back down again. Elbows up and back down again. Stretch your arms out straight. Turn your hands in and close them together. Bring them in and out. In and out. Up and down. Up and down. In and out. High and low. High and low. In and out and open. Sometimes my hands are at my side. Sometimes they go behind my back and high. Sometimes my hands go clap, clap, clap. And then I put them in my room. I will keep them as quiet as can be. Jesus. Help us 
to remember the story we dated, we took care of that great big giant with just one little stone and the power of God. In your name we pray. Amen. All right, let's say our Bible verse together. It is still that, that Bible verse about the power of the Holy Spirit. It gives us the strength that we need all the time. You ready? You will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you. Let's say it one more time, and I want to be able to hear you saying it out loud. If I can hear you out in the hallway, then I'm going to know that you're saying that really good. Are you ready? You will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you. All right, remember that. We don't have any birthdays today to sing about, so we're going to skip that. But I do have one thing I want to talk to you about, and that's right there behind me. Right over here, I'm going to walk over to this thing right here. This is like a big measuring stick thing. And it is for humble area assistance ministry. It's for families who don't have very much money, and they need some help. And so here at Tuskegee United Methodist Church, we're part of a, a partnership with him where we help to collect items to help them out. And so we're having a contest with the church to see how much we can fill of this big thing right here. We're going to put little balls in it. This whole thing right here is full of bunch of balls, and we want to fill all these balls all the way up to the top right here. But the way that we do that is, I need for you to bring in some canned goods or something that your mom might pick up at the grocery store, like maybe some oatmeal, maybe some rice, maybe some beans, maybe some um, cereal, something like that that families could use to help them live each day. And so if you could send in some of those things for us, you can put it in a little bag, you can stick it in your backpack, and when you come in, we can help you get it where it needs to go. Or we can come around to each of your classes and we can pick it up that way. Or we can maybe have a cart outside, and as your parents drive up it in the afternoons or the mornings to drop you off or to pick you up, or they walk in to pick you up or to drop you off, we can have a cart out there that's laid with them, and you can just put the stuff on it as you get out of the car. Whatever way, we want to be the one that helps to fill that up to the brim, okay? So I need your help to be able to do that. So let's bring in those donations to Humble Area Assistance Ministries. And how about families who are in need? All right, so it's time for our last song now, Shout to the Lord. I hope that you've had a great time in chapel with me today. I've enjoyed having you. I'll see you again tomorrow. But until then, let's sing our last song, Shout to the Lord. <laughs>